Hello everybody, welcome back to a brand new video on Hypixel Skyblock. So, two days ago, on stream, I reached 7.7 .7 million coins in the bank. And I spent virtually all of it on one item. What is that item? Well, it is this. A Bonzo Staff. So, what is a Bonzo Staff? Well, basically, a Bonzo Staff is a dungeon item that drops from the Floor 1 boss called Bonzo. And there's only a 1% chance to get it when you get an S on Floor 1. So, it is certainly not easy to get. But luckily, recently, there was this new collection in the game called the Boss Collection. And you just have to kill Bonzo, you know, around 75 times, and you automatically get the Bonzo Staff. So this has made the Bonzo Staff way more common, as you can see there's a guy right behind me who has one. But also, this is good because now, players that can't spend like, you know, 10 million coins on one item, they can still enjoy all of the benefits of a Bonzo Staff for only around 5 mil on the auction house. So in this video, I'm going to be talking about how the Bonzo Staff is really good and comparing it to some other common mage items like an AOTD and even a Frozen Scythe. So before this comparison starts, please make sure to subscribe to the channel because only around 0.3% of all viewers are subscribed and it would really help me out if you just click that subscribe button. It's free. Alright, now on with the video. Alright, so here I am in the graveyard. This is a pretty good place to do some damage tests. And we're going to be seeing the damage of a Bonzo Staff and an AOTD. So let's do this. So first of all, AOTD, the OG weapon, and now it's, you know, the ability is also really good for mages that just want to use their main sword. So when I use the AOTD ability on this zombie, this is with the legendary sheep pet by the way, and with the very wise armor, I do 11,940 damage with just the ability. And when I strike something, so I do only 18,000 damage, but you know, wise dragon armor doesn't really give you any buffs like that. Now, let's look at the Bonzo staff. So, let me just go to a different area here, and let's look at this zombie. So, here's a zombie, and as you can see, it's 14,200 damage. So, yes, a Bonzo staff does do more damage than AOTD, but not by a lot, right? It turns out that you have to pay around 7 million coins for an item that just does 3,000 more damage. That's not worth it at all, right? Wrong. So here's the thing. This Bonzo Staff, as you can see, is a 5-star dungeon item. So one tip when you're buying a Bonzo Staff is to not buy a 5-star Bonzo Staff. These usually cost 2 million to 1 million more than a clean Bonzo Staff, and it's extremely easy to level up to 5-star. It only needs 160 Wither Essence, which really is not that hard to get. If you're running low on Wither Essence, you can just ask your friends to upgrade for you, but really, do not pay a million coins just for something that can easily be done. So, the part where the Bonzo Staff gets insane is because, unlike an AOTD, it is a dungeon item. So as you can see, it has a gear score of 340, which is pretty good, but as you can see here, the damage and pretty much all the stats increase when it's in dungeons. That's a gray thing over here. As you can see with the AOTD, that is not present. There's only the Reforged staff. For this one, there's also the gray ones, which really help out in dungeons. Basically, that's all the additional stats that you get in dungeons when you're using this in the dungeons area. And if you apply this to that, as you can see, you get 500 intelligence from one Bonzo staff, and the stats just become absolutely crazy. So, let's look at some dungeon playing. So, by the way, I have to mention that the Frozen Scythe, well, that one's very popular, right? Well, you might have noticed recently that the Frozen Scythe isn't like 19 mil, 21 mil like it used to be on the auction house. The reason for this is because the Frozen Scythe has gotten a massive nerf. Now the Frozen Scythe is pretty comparable to the Bonzo Staff and far more expensive. I would really recommend getting a Bonzo Staff and adding some ultimate enchants like Ultimate Wise 3 onto it 
and upgrading it to 5 star, because a Frozen Scythe really isn't that good anymore. It literally got nerfed by 3 times. A weapon that used to do 120,000 damage now only does a third of that, or 40,000 damage. And it's the same in dungeons. It's not a dungeon buff at all, which really, really sucks. Alright everyone, it is time for the dungeon's footage. Let's see how this thing can take over a dungeon. Okay, start a new queue, and we're doing floor 1 just for now, just because it's a very popular floor to do. So a quick thing I have to mention, that some people might not exactly know what the ability of this thing is. Uh, as you can see, there's just people using it, but basically it's very self-explanatory. It shoots a balloon. That's all it does. It's just, look at this. Just one balloon. And it makes a nice popping sound. And people use it all the time in the dungeon sub because it's just so great. So yeah, if you're just wondering, that is uh, what, that's what it is. Oh great, we got some people uh, joining our dungeon group, so very nice. A few moments later. Okay, and looks like we now have everything we need. So everyone, this is the dungeon's footage of using the Bonzo Staff. Only floor one, nothing insane. But let's see how this thing can clean up dungeons. Looks so we've got a pretty good party going. No need for Archer, completely useless. And two Berserkers, I like it. We have a healer. And we also got some Y in um, Adaptive Armor stuff. Looks good. Looks like we have a really good party going, so I like it. So as you can see, when I'm holding the Bonzo Staff in dungeons, 2,000 intelligence. And let's do this, boys! That's not very easy. And yeah, it's just... Well, it just rips through every floor and everything imaginable. As you can see with this footage, I can just throw these from a distance and it is not a problem for me. I'm just gonna use the Bonzo Staff a little bit, I mean the Ornate Zombie Sword, and it'll not be a problem. And as you can see, we just took care of that lost adventurer very easily. And yeah, as you can see, we're not really running out of that much mana. We still have a good amount of mana left. And it's doing about 40,000 damage. Look at that. Look what an improvement that is. See? That's such an improvement. See, the AOTD only does, you know, 20,000 damage. But this one, it's doing a good 47,000 damage. Look at that. See, this is why this item is so good. Because... It just has so much intelligence, and it becomes so much better in dungeons. AOTD, as you can see, only does 20,000 damage, but this one does 47,000 damage. And keep in mind that this is, uh, it does 47,000 damage when my talismans, if you go to my talismans here, they're all reforged for damage. They're not even reforged for intelligence, which is really great. So as you can see, it does a lot of damage. And you're going to be getting similar damage numbers with the Frozen Scythe now. A Frozen Scythe used to do a lot more, but unfortunately, it suffered a big nerf. And this thing has more area of effect damage. It's easier to aim with this because the projectiles are larger. So that is also a helpful point. So for these, I can just use Ink Wand on these guys. Very easy. And yeah, Ink Wand still does 166,000 damage, even though it got nerfed. I would recommend keeping your Ink Wand, um, simply because the price has gone down so much that you won't really make your money back. And it's, it's just kind of worth having it around, so yeah, that's what I have to say about the Ink Wand. So yeah, here's just a time lapse of me going through this dungeon, everyone.
Alright everybody, and there ya go. So we would have gotten an S, uh, but unfortunately we failed the puzzle. So that was uh, pretty sad. Um, but anyway, as you can see uh, from that footage, I was just destroying everything. I did not die a single time. I could solo all of the mini-bosses, all of the lost adventures, everything with the Bonzo staff. So yeah, everyone, if you have, you know, if you're, if you're a mage, if you have, you know, uh, a lot of money to burn, Get a Bonzo Staff, don't spend that extra 2 mil to get a Frozen Scythe, because really this thing is really great, it doesn't cost that much mana, only if you 41 mana, even, but despite, you know, it has Ultimate Wise 3. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video, everybody, of me getting the Bonzo Staff, and with this, you know, I'm going to be doing a lot more dungeons, lots more of fun stuff, so make sure to subscribe again, and like the video, and see you guys in the next one. Bye!